today we are discussing the one more concept uh, what are the different types of conductors is available in overhead transmission and distribution system the types of the conductors one is the solid conductor second one is the standard conductor third one is the composite standard conductor fourth one is the bundled conductor one by one we are explaining one is called solid conductor solid one is called solid conductor second one is called standard conductor second one is called standard conductor third one is called composite composite standard conductor composite standard conductor fourth one is called bundle conductor fourth one is called bundle conductor these are the four types of conductors is available in overhead transmission and distribution area one by one we are first if you go for the solid conductor solid first if you go for the solid conductor solid conductor means this is the solid conductor this is the solid conductor this 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 is the solid conductor this solid conductor we can made with copper we can made with copper the conductivity is more the conductivity is high the conductivity is more the conductivity is more this is the solid conductor obviously the mechanical strength is high the mechanical strength the mechanical strength is high the skin effect the skin effect is also high the skin effect also is high in solid conductor and one more is the stringing the stringing is the stringing is difficult stringing is nothing but this is the tower this is the tower in this tower this is the conductor this is the insulation the mechanical strength is more we cannot bend the we cannot bend the stringing of the conductor is also more difficult compared to standard conductors go for standard conductor standard conductor in this standard conductor this is the standard conductor this is the standard conductor these are called strands stn these are called strands these are called strands standard conductor is nothing but one or more strands one or more strands twisting to each other you will get the twisting each other you will get the more mechanical strength mechanical strength also is high this strands also we can made with copper obviously the conductivity obviously the conductivity is also the conductivity is also is high this is the standard conductor the uh, the stringing of the conductor is easy why because the mechan uh, why because here uh, little bit less in mechanical strength if uh, here ka it will be bending here ka the stringing of the conductor is easy the stringing of the conductor is easy here here skin effect is skin effect is less compared to solid conductor the skin effect is coming only for ac power supply the skin effect is more in we are using in solid conductor the skin effect is more we are using in standard conductor the skin effect it will be the skin effect it will be reducing standard conductor in this standard conductor this standard conductor is the copper standard conductor in this copper standard conductors have to we are using this this standard conductor we are using in a copper material so the cost of the it will be high the cost is high 
and the second one is the skin effect is reducing skin effect is reducing but the cost is more so that we cannot prepare this copper material after that if you go for the aluminium standard conductor aluminium standard conductor aluminium standard conductor means all stands all stands we can made with aluminium previously you were made with copper we are using the copper more cost that's why we cannot recommend that copper material after that we are going uh, aluminium standard conductor this aluminium standard conductor all stands we can made with aluminium here also one of the disadvantages is there all stands all stands we made with aluminium the mechanical strength it will be less the mechanical strength the mechanical strength it will be less the mechanical strength is less the mechanical strength is less means pole to pole the transmission line the pole to pole the transmission line sag the pole to pole transmission line the sag it will be increasing the mechanical strength is low in this uh, uh, aluminum standard conductor the sag it will be using this aluminum the cost it will be reducing cost is less we are using this aluminum stands the cost it will be reduced the cost it will be reduced but this also we cannot recommend why because the sag it will be more after that it will come into composite standard conductor composite standard conductor composite standard conductor in this composite standard conductor means this is the conductor in this outer stands we can made with aluminum inner stand we can made with steel this aluminum have the high conductivity the outer stands have the more conductivity the inner stands have the more mechanical strength we can more mechanical strength the overall this conductor the overall this conductor the mechanical strength it will be increase obviously the conductivity also it will be increasing the conductivity also it will be increasing in this conduct for the example ac src ac sr conduct ac sr conductors means aluminum conductors steel reinforced aluminum conductor steel reinforced the example for this composite standard conductor example for this ac src conductors in this composite standard conductors the stands are 1 or 6 or 12 or 18 or 24 is so on this way is available stands in each conductor have the stands this way is available we can calculate the how many stands number of stands number of number of stands in conductor is equal to 3n square minus 3n plus 1 you will get 3n is common n minus 1 plus 1 here n is called number of layers n is called number of layers then you will get n is called number of layers this is the formula for the to calculate number of stands in one conductor how in one conductor how many stands is there for example this is the this is this way n is called number of layers how many layers you know you will get how many stands is there in this conductor you can calculate for example for example n is the 2 means number of layers is the 2 you can calculate 3 2 2 minus 1 plus 1 3 into 2 6 2 minus 1 1 plus 1 6 into 1 6 plus 1 you can't stand means 2 layers this is the 2 layers this is the 1 layer this is the 1 layer means 7 number of stands number of stands is 7 you can calculate this way 
you can calculate this way number of stands after that diameter overall diameter of this conductor how you can calculate 2m minus 1 into d this d is called this d is called small this d is called stands diameter stands diameter n is n is called number of layers d is called each stand dia each stand dia total overall diameter of the conductor is, is equal to for example same number of layers is 2 the dia is dia is for example 1 the dia is the dia is for example 1 the layers is number of layers is 2 if you go for the overall dia is equal to 2 into n is 2 minus 1 dia is 1 2 into 2 4 minus 1 into 1 4 minus 1 3 into 1 you will get 3 the dia is 3 you can calculate this with the help of these two formula then how many stands is there you can calculate with the help of this formula the overall dia number of layers has given each stand diameter is given the overall diameter we can calculate with the help of this formula fourth one is called bundle conductor fourth one is called bundle conductor bundle bundle conductor in normal this is the this is the normal conductor way this is the normal conductor way bundle conductor means this is the bundle conductor this is the bundle conductor here also operating is the 400 kV here also operating is the 400 kV voltage transmission line this is the normal conductor this is the bundle conductor this is the bundle conductor this is the normal conductor what is bundle conductor bundle conductor is nothing but one or more sub one or more sub contactor in single phase one or more subcontactors in single phase in single phase one or more subcontactors in single phase this each dia is called r this the distance between these two subcontactors is called s in this s is very very more compared with r the spacing between the two subcontactors is more compared with sing, uh, compare compared to single subcontactor radius single subcontactor single subcontactor radius in this all sub all subcontactors are running in parallelly so you will get more current density you will get more current density you will get more current density and one more advantage in this bundle conductor we are using in a composite standard conductor you will get one more time again the current capacity it will be increased double current capacity it will be increased the composite standard conductor we are using in this bundle conductor you will get more current capacity it will be increased what are the advantages in normal conductors compared to using this bundle conductor what are the advantages is there you are using this normal conductor you are using you are using this normal conductor the field the electric field it will be increased more we are using this bundle conductor the electric field will be reducing means the first point is the the electrical field intensity it will be reduced surface of the conductor the surface of the conductor the electrical field intensity it will be reduced the corona loss it will be reduced how the electrical or the 
conductor surrounding the air ionization it will be less the field intensity it will be less the air ionization it will be less corona loss it will be reduced compared to this normal transmission line normal uh, conductor we are using this particular conductor second one the inductance surface the inductance surface it will be reduced the inductance surface it will be reduced the power system stability it will be increasing the stability it will be increasing the power system stability it will be increasing third one the capacitance surface it will be increased the capacitance surface is, is increasing that corresponding this it will be the characteristic the characteristic the characteristic impedance it will be reducing in long transmission line the characteristic impedance it will be reducing these are all the advantages we are using in this bundle conductor over normal conductors